you know, when we say hi to our white neighbors, we have to completely know that nothing is required, not a nod, not an acknowledgement, not a high back, not even if it's just that high or like, okay, I have to, nothing is required, but your high had to be free and full of love. Um, and as far as this fear, forgetting the fear, you have to break down all of its parts because what what's hard for you to forget is the ball of fear. So the whole consciousness of fear is in that particular real situation that happened directly to you and your family. Um, so in that fear, there's also fear that is not yours. This is not me. This is not I. This is not mine. This is not myself. And you need to break down. It's like when the Buddha talks about the ox cart, or we often use the analogy of taking out a car, you take out the brakes, you take out the oil, you take out the transmission, the tire, you know, if you drive a Tesla, I don't know what's inside that. But, you know, if you take out all of these parts of the car, you put it back together, you see, oh, it's not a car. It's all of these conditions. So the same thing with that fear and that exact situation, you have to enter into the meditation cushion of police brutality, um, you know, it's very racially targeted. Um, I mean, the slave patrollers, the police, the original law enforcement were slave patrollers. And that's not just black bodies, but anything that wasn't that didn't receive the white card when they arrived here um, to this country and look in this deep trauma. So then when that fear, when you have that fear and that harm that was directly towards you, you will see all of its parts. So there's a story there. And right now it's just fear that has happened to me. This, this came really close to home and could have caused even worse harm. Um, so that fear is just full of a bunch of stuff. So you got to break down all of its parts and see the reality for what it is. So when that fear rises, this is fear. This is fear from the situation that I have experienced. I know this to be true, but I know that this true experience is full with a bunch of other stuff by way of the six senses, right? Media, our country, the land, the soil, the air that we breathe, the water, the media are, we are in this fishbowl together. This is us. <laughs> Whiteness is just not in white bodies. Um, so when we break it down to its fine parts, we dismantle it, we destruct it as the Buddha teaches us. And then we put it back together. Fear becomes almost not real. And I'm not saying that like with a spiritual bypass, but because you've entered into it and you've seen all of it, you say, ah, this fear is built off of, you know, the ways of the world and how I see it through my experience. Um, and when you can break yourself through that and free through that, enter into it and release yourself from it. When you forgive, you won't forget, you will recall, but it will no longer be full of all that other stuff. It will be just the reality of that experience and it will start to cease to exist. You will suffer less and suffer differently, which is the ultimate teaching of the Buddha. Um, yeah, it's, you know, right now your fear is full, <laughs> full of a self, honestly. Yeah. Thank you.